The cold will hold as we head into the second week of February. Welcome to Upper Michigan Source Weather on Demand. I'm meteorologist Carl Bonak. And on the uh, 7th of February, Friday, the official high was 17, the low six below that uh, six below zero. That makes it 39 days this winter so far with temperatures zero or below. Even in the big winters of uh, uh, 78, 79 and 93, 94, we didn't have this many up to this point. And as far as the uh, Temperatures through the first week of February, the average high has been 15, the average low about 8 below zero. That puts us over 10 degrees below the long-term average. It's been uncomfortable uh, the past couple of days because, well, we've had strong low pressure over eastern Canada, strong high pressure first in the plains and then to the south of us. That gives us what we call a strong gradient and rather blustery winds out of the west to southwest. These systems are shifting off to the east, so we expect less wind. The main jet stream or storm track, uh, the greatest temperature contrast down to the south of us. That's where the storms coming out the Pacific will be moving. And for us, well, we're caught in the uh, northern stream of cold, dry air. And we should stay there for the weekend into early next week. Uh, Saturday morning, the way it looks, we'll have temperatures starting below zero, much of the western interior to near zero close to Lake Superior. The winds will be lighter out of the southwest, maybe a flurry in the copper country. Then in the afternoon, winds may start to veer around to the west in the western UP, but otherwise much lighter southwesterly winds with temperatures in the teens, some increase in clouds. Then on Sunday, as uh, the low that will pass to our south moves off to the east, new Arctic high pressure begins to build into the plains. An upper air trough grazes our area, so we should have a fair amount of clouds, maybe a little light snow and flurries almost everywhere. The best chance near Lake Superior with the north components of the wind, but no significant snow expected. Your TV six day forecast. Temperatures begin to cool also on Sunday and then Monday, probably the coldest of this uh, six day period with highs in the single numbers to around 10. Monday night, probably the coldest as a ridge of high pressure moves across teens, maybe even 20 below zero in some of the coldest spots. Look at that warm up though, mid and late portions of the week. Highs should move close to maybe even somewhat above average into the 20s.